What's going on everybody? It's Joe from the Acceptable Casualties. Back today with a little special delivery I got from Russ over at Sick Creations. I uh, put in a custom order to get one of his paint racks done. Wanted to get something a little bit bigger, um, so I had uh, some room to grow into it. So I ended up getting this, uh, this paint rack set uh, with, I think it's like 84 pots. Uh, room for 84 pots in this one. And then he sent me a small shade rack as well, which has like six, and then room for brushes. Uh, and all of this. So let's take a little bit of a closer look here and kind of just go down and see what this thing, uh, see what this thing looks like. So uh, up here, as you guys can see, um, I can fit my GW paints in here as well as some of the Vallejo eye drops and then some of the Battlefront ones as well. The way Russ um, puts these together is he does the um, the drill holes for it. So the Games Workshop pots or like some of your wider pots will fit in that top part, and then you have the uh, smaller center hole which will fit in there for um, from some of your eyedroppers. <clears throat> so if you have multiple kinds of pots, uh, they all kind of fit into the same stand, which is really, really nice. Because uh, I know with some of them you get like, you know, you either go one way or the other, or some just don't fit. And it's, just, it's just how it works out. So Russ puts these together so you can get uh, both your pots or your eyedroppers kind of fit in any one of these holes that you have over here. Um, up here, some of the other stuff in here, he drills in some of the, uh, smaller holes in here so you can fit some of your paintbrushes in. I use mine for files. Uh, same thing down here. Uh, I got some other files and some other paintbrushes down there. So yeah, if you got like the round, the round bottom ones, they fit in really well with that. So you can have all your stuff here for like painting, modeling, everything that you need. I know he does these in uh, I think 24 and 36 uh, inch wide ones right now and I think they're two or three tiers I have to I have to look I know he, this one was custom so it's a little bit different than what he usually does uh, some of those stuff to point out in here just like everything else this is yeah this is all solid wood so the, all three tiers are solid wood um, so yeah this thing I think <laughs> like 25 pounds or something like that it's, it's something ridiculous um, so also that you something else that you can look at for uh, the side, he puts like this rubber padding on the sides. Uh, it's similar on the back as well, and it's also underneath. I don't want to flip it because I don't want to dump all my paints. But um, he has that rubber backing on there, so if you put it on your tables, it's not going to scrape anything. So you don't have like the wood beaten up on your uh, on your tables if you need to move it around, or if you have like a dedicated painting area. Um, like I said, it's, just, it's not wood on wood, so you're not going to ruin anything, which is kind of nice. And you know, all the stuff that he does, he sent me painted. I mean, he primed it black. Um, I talked to him about it. I think he said he's starting to open it up now where you can um, you can request a color So if you had like a certain color in mind that you wanted to do you just have to give him the heads up and um, He'll he'll spray it down for you whatever color that you were looking for if you need to, like match your room or Match your table setup, or maybe you just want to look at something bright orange while you're painting I mean the, the options are pretty much there You just got to run it by him and see what he can do for you guys But um, yeah overall this thing is awesome. I know he has some up on his eBay store right now I think there's like one up there and I think I think he's working on a couple others, but um, if you send him a send him a message on there, he um, he'll probably be able to throw something custom together if you guys want something a little bit bigger, maybe something a little bit smaller. Like I said, he's pretty flexible with all that kind of stuff. But I just wanted to show you guys this. I just got it in because I'm redoing uh, my paint room upstairs, uh, and I'm getting like a new table and everything set up, so I get like a little dedicated workshop area. So I just figured you guys might want to check this out. It's pretty cool. Uh, like I said I love it. So far, I got all the stuff that I need uh, sitting out here right now. I got room to grow as far as my uh, my paints and my brushes and everything else. So, as I said, thanks for watching. Give uh, give Russ a look over at Sick Creations. I'll leave a link down at the bottom of the video like I always do, and I'll catch you guys later.